All right. So, what are we doing? Oh, we're dying. That's right. Oh, that's right. We're trying to level up our pixelizer. Yeah, that's cool. Cool. We got it. Uh, that's not the right way, is it? No. Okay. Just making sure. You never know. Well, I guess you, you would have known if you didn't just go on a mission to save a wasp. You know, for me to save a wasp is a big deal, by the way. If you're unaware, wasps and bees are uh, among my biggest fears. So I could easily just murder them, slice their head off, put it on a pike, which would actually be more like a toothpick. That would actually... Okay, so in my head, I'm thinking that's a hilarious concept to talk about. But in real life, that would be so weird. And creepy and gross. Like, every bug you kill, you cut off its head and put it on a toothpick. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> that might be too much. I'm not sure. <laughs> but thankfully, I don't have to worry about that because I don't kill bugs. But we must first repair our ship. Spiders especially. Spiders get the VIP treatment. Spiders get pictures taken of them, and that is as VIP as you can get as a bug. They... I love spiders, dude. I, Not just Spider-Man. Like, I, I love spiders. I've talked about this before, but they get such a bad rap, and it's unfortunate... Oh, we need to go somewhere else? Oh, maybe go back up then? I think we do have to go in the cave system. Wait. Find someone to help you repair your ship. Okay, never mind. No. Wait, what? Hold on. Just a minute here. Oh, there we go. Okay, never mind. That's right, yeah, because at the end we ride down the water. That's right. I remember now. I love that part. I love it every time we do it. What I don't love is my Spanish book lying to us blatantly. Because there's a woman. Okay, so there's a story going on in the game, or in the book. It's like a Spanish soap opera, honestly. It's not far from it. But the characters, we know them very well, and they utilize those characters in the book. I've talked about this before. I think it's a great way to learn, being familiar with these characters that they create. And then, so one of the girls is named Claudia. Claudia is my favorite. I love Claudia. Claudia es bonita. E y simpática. Pero Claudia's uh, el el nombre de Claudia no es Claudia. Es uh, es posible que el nombre es Susie. Now, how did I get to that point? Well, I was doing homework last night because I'm a good boy and a good student. And there was a part where you have to listen to someone talk about their house. And she was one of the videos. But her name wasn't Claudia. The videos have the title of the name of the person. Um, so the first one was like, Tony. And yeah, he said his name's Tony. Alright, I believe it. But then, Claudia, it said, Susie. Can you believe this? I, I feel betrayed beyond belief, fact or fiction. Hosted a majority of the time by Richard Frakes? No. Ben Frakes? No. Dang it. 
Robert Frakes. Maybe. I don't remember. I'm sorry. Wanna do it again? Okay, let's see what we got here. Cool. Oh, man. It was... It was so disappointing when I found out that Claudia might not be real. In a Spanish curriculum that... <laughs> it's the dumbest thing to get mad about or sad about, but... I was sad, dude. I really was. Um... I like Claudia, though. I was alone in liking her, actually. Unfortunately, in my Spanish 1 class, it was kind of a running joke that... Oh, Trog likes Claudia. Haha, <laughs> K-I-S-S-I-N-G. In a tree, or whatever, even though that's very dangerous. Do you think in Britain, instead of doing the K-I-S-S-I-N-G... It's more like S N O G G I N G. We must assist the Galactic Rangers. I think so. Because I brought that up, I guess. Oh, okay, we gotta shoot the things. Oh yeah, Call of Duty I forgot to watch there's a Call of Duty Blackout trailer. And I guess the beta's going on right now too, and I think it's on PS4. I want to do that. The issue is that you can't so I have the beta on PC and I guess if you have a beta code you don't have to get another one um, the thing is when I got into the beta for the PC I got it through my internet service and I don't think I can just request a second one because I want it on PS4 now that doesn't make sense so we're probably stuck to PC I don't know though. I am excited at the prospect of playing it on PlayStation 4 though. I hope I'm not turning into a, a console peasant again. My days of console peasantry I thought were over, but you know what? Every time I play a game on here, on stream, PC or otherwise, it's uh, I notice there's one glaring thing that I do that exhibits my peasantry and that's that I play with a controller all the time all the time I have played out of all the games I've played on stream of which there are honestly probably over 200 I've played on stream not completed but played I think I've only used mouse and keyboard for a hand like maybe five Maybe six. I know Call of Duty Modern Warfare 1, when I was doing the Star Wars mods, that definitely I used mouse and keyboard. And Call of Duty Black Ops 4 beta. Oh yeah, that's right. I was really mad about that. They don't let you use the gamepad in the demo. Although I think the good news is that if we do decide to... If we decide to do a beta from on the PS4, we're going to die, by the way. We're dead. Um, if we choose to do it on the PS4, I think, there, I think it's an open beta. I could be wrong on that, but I think so. I think... Um, speaking of weird things, I was watching someone else earlier today, and their stream was filthy. I mean, like, positively filthy. Not their stream, but their chat. It was really... Like, I normally don't really mind it. Being on the outside as an observer, as a chatter, I don't usually mind it that much. But, man, it was, it was bad. Um, I think it may have been the fact that she was dressed up as D.Va from Overwatch. It may have gotten the, the testosterone kicking a bit. Not that I would know anything about that. 
but just in case, it's possible. Um, you know, I said that I'd play this without cheats in my head. I might not have expressed that outwardly, actually. But I don't want to sit here and do this for 10 hours. So we're just going to do 10 of these guys. Woohoo, I'm going to blow you up, bro. Hey, hey, hey. You ready? You ready for this? Let's do it again, everybody. I'm gonna sit on my do what I do when I say. Um. Oh, yeah. I was listening to my stream last night. Not for last night's stream, but the day. No, wait. It was. Yeah, it was. It was yesterday's stream, wasn't it? <laughs> um. It was a stream where. I was playing Ratchet and Clank, and I said, someone said something about Spider-Man, and I thought, um, I thought at the moment I was okay, but now I'm wondering if, um, if they come in that I should probably apologize, because I listened back to it, and it sounded like I was really mad at them or something or holding a grudge of some sort I don't really know what was going on there um it's because of oh one more hit there we go um oh that was that was one more hit ratchet what happened there, bro? Um, they asked if I wasn't playing Spider-Man. Or if I was tired of Spider-Man yet. And the way I responded, it sounded a little rude. I, I'm so confused. I thought that was the last one. Okay. Maybe it's they do more damage the more you have or something? So if they're watching, I am sorry. I apologize. I think in the moment I was getting very frustrated with the game and it, it came out in that that response. So I, I do apologize for that. I feel really bad. All systems operational, but we should get back to the Hall of Heroes. It sounded really bad. <laughs> uh, I feel I feel awful. There's still a few blarg in the city. We must have missed them during our sleep up the perimeter. Right. You better check the Hall of Heroes and make sure they didn't make it inside. Uh. In the meantime, there's a friend not far okay. from your position who can help uh. you out. More His enemies. Name is Al. I was gonna wait until after training to introduce you, but now's as good Enemies as over there or behind us? I guess I could have turned around. Let's see. But I am pretty sure it's these guys. Oh boy! Okay, I think we got everyone. Do I hear a do I hear a doggy? I don't know, do I? Oh, <laughs> Loser. <laughs> Come on. Come on. I got it. Give it to me. To me. I, I used to think that was a funny thing, and now I don't know. I feel bad laughing at Timmy and Jimmy on South Park, because, I mean, it's kind of making light of 
disabilities. And I don't... I'm a very strong proponent against that. Opponent to it, I guess, is actually what I should have said. I'm a strong opponent to that. <laughs> I guess... Yeah! Wait! I'm a proponent. I'm an opponent. Oh my gosh, I just realized. Proponent and opponent, I'm pretty sure, are the opposites. Which sounds like a show you'd find on TV Land at 5 in the morning. I'm not entirely sure it's not something you'd find on TV Land at 4 in the morning. 5 in the Did I say 4 or 5? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Just like TV Land. <laughs> just kidding. I really like those channels that continue to show old programming. I think it's important to maintain that history. Even if it's a little more romanticized. Because they never really have a bad show on channels like Boomerang and TV Land, I don't think. It's usually, like, good shows. So it makes you think, oh wow, every show back then was amazing. But in reality, I don't think that's true. I'm sure back then there were shows that are just as bad as some shows that are on now. I don't know if I'll be able to compare them, but... Or, I don't know, maybe not, honestly. Because back then, I don't think TV was as... I don't think people spent as much money making TV back then. Throwing, like, a ma majillion. That's, yep, a majillion. That's, that's what I wanted to say. Thank you. Thank you, Brain. Like, throw a bajillion shows at the wall and then see what sticks, that kind of thing. That is something, that's a practice that I don't think was around back then, based on what I've seen. Like there, in terms of game shows, maybe actually, there are so many game shows that would blow your mind. But the like fall season, the summer, the fall mo TV season, the winter TV season, or spring season, that kind of stuff where they throw in like 10,000 shows, and then at the end they... At the end they renew some, and they cancel the other 9,997. I don't think that's how it happened back in the day. Could be wrong, though. Again, I didn't live back then, as hard as it might be to believe. I never lived in the 40s, 50s, 40s and 50s, or 30s or 20s. Never lived then. So everything I hear right now is pure hearsay. I have to be honest, sometimes I kind of forget that it's hearsay and not heresy. I didn't realize until maybe like two or three years ago actually that hearsay and heresy were different. I had no idea. Okay. I'm curious to see what kind of weapons we can get in the original Ratchet and Clank. Uh oh I think there's a Gadgetron here that maybe I should have gotten. That's okay. Come on, Clank. Let's make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, uh Woo! <laughs> you did it. Oh, he's dead too. Holy heck. Already. We're getting a lot of ammo for our Pixelizer, which is good because we're about to be done with our Plasma Striker. Although it's my favorite weapon, probably, honestly. I, Other than the Goatinator, obviously. I always forget what to do here. Oh, that's right. There's a, There should be a thing. There you go. Look at that. Speedrun strats, guys. 
I'm so good. Speed runs. Yeah. Oh, we're so close, dude. <gasps> Darn. That would be a cool trophy if you could take... You could uh, free all of those things that are in straps. Okay. You know what? I'm not going to say it until we get to that point. But... I am... Oh. I am hopeful of something if it transpires. Transpires or transpires? Probably transpires. <laughs> that was a really dumb question. I'm just realizing it. Thank you. Thank you for listening, but also thank you for not making fun of me for my terrible English. I never ain't done spoke real good. Okay. Here we go. Not sure why... Like, so if I have my weapon out for too long, it doesn't pull up the weapon when I press left trigger to go into zoom mode. Yes! Plasma Striker's done! Oh, it didn't kill him, though. It's, whatever. it's weird. Like, if you notice, I'm holding my ratchet sometimes. I don't, not like, you know, my, my literal ratchet in the game. Not like a stuffed animal ratchet that I have or anything. We're going to have a movie cutscene in one second. And yep, like I said, look at that. Boom. I don't know why, I was about to tell you guys I was really excited that uh, we got, I got a trophy in the game for doing this in 70 seconds, this course. And then I realized, oh wait, you guys are here for that. <laughs> got him! Honestly, I feel like the the one we went on was a glitched version. So I don't know how I feel about that. Let me show you what I mean. Unless it's just... I don't know. Maybe it's different on the difficulty or something? I swear... Okay. So, like, the one in front of us right here, I think that was out already. And then this one, that's fine. No, I don't even know what I'm talking about, honestly. Oh! Okay, hold on. Okay, you know, that's great. I wanted to come down here anyways, so thank you. Gave me the opportunity to do so without making me look like I was giving up on my dreams. Of which I have none. Okay. <clears throat> I feel like this one, these were protruded indefinitely. Or these things right here, these like sections where you have to jump, do the wall jumps. Hey, you always my own. Oh, yes, yes. Um. I feel like the top ones were moving in and out, but the bottom ones were not. That's one weird thing going on. Yeah, like this one right here. These were ex these were protruded indefinitely except for these top ones. So I feel like my... I feel like my trophy is invalidated because of that. You could say do it again, because obviously the course is working, but I don't have a way to time myself. Get out of here. You think I have a phone or something? No. Stop. Stop assuming my my means. Me 
I think this level is actually in Tools of Destruction. Which is kind of neat to me for some reason. I don't know. I just I didn't know that there were any levels between the games. Like that were in multiple games. If that's the case, I can see the fun in that. Okay. I'm counting on you, Ratchet. You got it, Captain. Whew. I'm thinking it's gonna be a Ratchet and Clank night, honestly. Even with the without the the Wasp Chronicles, I think. I think it's clear. Wait, is that skid big marks up ahead? Okay, we need two levels there, two there, two there, two there, two there, three there, four there. Oh my gosh, Dude, this is bad. This is a good level to get that Apocalypse Glove, though. That Apocalypse Glove. I think, because it'll do a bunch of stuff or something. I don't even know. Let's try it again. Yay! We got seven now. Goodness, that's great. Oh, here's another. Oh, nice. A lot of customers for this one. You know what? How long will it take to level this up? I love it. Let's see. Got 48 left. Hmm. Really strange. It's like not leveling up at all. That's weird. I don't... That's weird. I don't know why that's not helping. <clears throat> if we do two at the same time, we might be able to get more. I'm so confused. That one didn't seem like it went up at all either. Hmm. Strange. Okay. Get some ammo in here. <clears throat> Which is a really strange place to just see ammo floating around, but... That's alright. You have to use a fusion grenade to get in there, so maybe that's why they give you some. Do goats sound like that? I don't think goats sound like that, guys. And this game came out after the... the big goat voice phase of the internet. <laughs> they have no excuses. <laughs> oh. Okay, that that is going up. Maybe I'm just expecting it to go up a little higher, like or faster. But never mind. No, it's uh, it's going up. That's all that matters, honestly. Uh -oh, reinforcements. That's the last of them. <clears throat> that was impressive. I'm getting concerned. <laughs> Okay, so we need to get those sand sharks. Um, which apparently are not over here. They are somewhere else. We got lost like this last time, actually. <laughs> yeah, it's my 
I think I know where to go though. There's we're on the right track. There's still a few sand sharks out there, little dude. Think you can take care of them? Okay. It's up there, I think. Is where we didn't go before. Although I don't think we went around here at all either. Okay, let's try and do this a little bit. Actually, this might be a good place to do the Pixelizer. We're getting there. We're getting there. Almost level nine. I believe there are a few sand sharks left. That was cool. It's almost like the part in Spider-Man where I jump off the wall and then punch people. Oh wait, what's that? My producer's telling me that despite learning that move, I've never used it since. Uh, that is correct. I forgot. I forgot about that, and I also forgot that that move existed. That might spice up the combat a little bit more for us. That's not a plateau, is it? I don't know if that's a plateau, man. Okay. Good. We want it to be sending more to us. We want it to send us unlimited things. I never thought I'd be so excited for unlimited spawns. <laughs> Come on. There is a homing attack going on. Interesting. Wow. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Hey, have either of you little dudes seen my agent? I feel kind of bad leaving him out here. He doesn't do well with nature. Your agent? I'm not sure I know who you're talking about. Oh, that's right. I think I do actually. That's definitely what I was gonna suggest. Thank you, Clank. Um Oh, I think this is where we get our uh water displacer or whatever. Water displace somatic. If I wanted to displace, I'd go to a BET cipher. Future consumer, we thank you for your interest in the Skid McMarks. That's for all you uh, fans of rap out there. Sensors are picking up a strange energy signature near the swing shot targets. I believe it may be a gadget from Drek Industries. Okay. Right, let's have a look around. Oh, I see you two dudes fell in my store. Hey, it doesn't look like much now, but So I found out that there's actually that invincibility cheat. You know how we were having such a hard time with our race last night? Well, there's an invincibility cheat, which we have on right now. And it'll allow you in that race to just go right through all of the explosive boxes, thereby not slowing you down at all. And I just wanted you guys to know that. But I want you also to know that no, we did not waste our time, because we actually did it legit. I was surprised how many people in the comments were admitting they did this. They weren't even admitting it. They were like, oh, cool, thanks, dude. Like, oh, yeah, cool. You know, nonchalantly just admitting that you cheated that trophy. I don't know. <clears throat> I guess it's not much different than me beating challenge mode with cheats. 
Now that I say that, you know. Can y'all each my head? Oh, that's your tail. I thought it was your foot. I thought it was your foot sticking out. Oofball. This isn't the part with the. No. No, it's not. I was gonna say the part with the sewer where you have to swim as fast as you can. Originally designed to unclog Valkyrie toilets, Ratchet would find the hydro displacer invaluable in navigating the sewers of the galaxy. We should search the area for Skid's agent. He may need our assistance. Thank you, Clank. Intrusion detected in sector four. <laughs> yeah. You know, maybe I should do this. Too late. Okay. Yes! Level 9. Cool. We're getting there. I know I can smack the bolt, the bits, or the pixels, with my ratchet, but I don't want to. I think it's more fun to shoot them to bits. Even boxes are fun to shoot with bits. I actually found out there's a... <laughs> I don't know if I ever talked about this. A little bit ago, I found out that this game had a pre-order bonus with a weapon. It was a pre-order bonus weapon. And usually, when I see that, I'm thinking, oh, well, of course, you'll be able to just get the weapon eventually in the game, or maybe you buy it with DLC. No? No. First time ever I've seen a pre-order bonus actually mean something. You cannot get the weapon by any means other than buying it, pre-ordering the game. So, yeah, anyways. it was That was a weird thing for me to come across. Because if you notice, when we have the hollow guys below, like in this spot right here that's red, we have the hollow guys there. There's still one missing, right? Right here? Yeah. That's where the other weapon would go. And if you're wondering what weapon it is, it is called the Bouncer. And it shoots out a ball that bounces an enemy and then bounces the enemy to another enemy or something like that. Something like that. It's really weird. Thankfully, it doesn't look as great as some of these other weapons that we have. So it's not like we're missing out on a game-changing weapon. Okay, it is going up very slowly, but it is going up. It's still sad, though. Like, I want to have everything. Which is why we're doing this pla road to platinum. Oh, yeah. Dude, that reach, though. So big. That's beautiful. A girl at school told me that if I'm a germaphobe, I probably shouldn't have kids. And I was like, yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're correct about that. I don't know why I thought about that just now, actually. I found out that she has a daughter and a husband. It's crazy. Crazy that there's a person that has lived their life. Or something. Okay.
See you around the system, dude. <laughs> That's right. Ooh. Okay. Where are we going now? Where to next? I believe Planet Rilgar would be a good choice. This is the one with the the thing trying to uh, drown us. The objective is trying to drown us. Oh man, I'm really scared. Because tomorrow I actually go to court for my traffic ticket. I'm scared. Because <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know if I should appeal to his humorous side or his sympathetic side. I can't seem to mix both. In a timely fashion for this. It's weird. I guess I, at the end of the day, the most important thing I have to get across is the fact that I've been driving for 10 years without incidents. So. I just. I need to do that, I guess. Everything other than that is superfluous as far as I'm concerned. I'm dead. Oh, or not. Eh, or, eh, maybe. Let's see, where am I? I think I'm dead. That's not the big fish. Oh. That's the big fish. The other one was not. That was. 